Hey guys, so today I have a really fun no heat hairstyle for, you know, either a bad hair day, coming back to school, or just to get your hair off your, um, like, hair up for summer. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get into this tutorial. The things that you're going to need for this are um, some ponytails. I think you're going to need just two. Um, this one's sort of like a dark brown, so it matches my hair really well. This one's black, so it just doesn't really matter. Um, and then you're going to need some bobby pins. That is it. You just need those two, I guess, categories of hair holding. I don't know. Um, and then if you do want to add like a little bit of wave to your hair, you could, but I wanted to keep this no heat and I already had natural wave to my hair, so I was like, okay, well I'm fine. So um, all you're going to do is take out a little section of hair from the rest, leave that out, gather the rest, take the one that mat the ponytail that matches your hair color. And go ahead and put that into a low side pin. Okay, and then bring it towards the front. And then this hair that you left out, you're going to go ahead and start braiding. So just do a basic braid. Alright, once you're to as far as you can go, take this braid and wrap it around your ponytail so that the pony ends up not showing. Can you see I see that? And then take your bobby pins and I like to do an X in the back so that it really stays. So far, that is what you have. And then the next step, um, you just have this, um, your hair in the side ponytail. And you could stop just here, but I like to do something that's really different. So look in your hair for the longest sections of hair um, on either side, so it's not. Um, I have a lot of layers, so I guess the longest would be around here. that out and you're gonna have to do this twice you're gonna have to have two um, sections that are the longest or maybe like first and second longest so take the very longest and just braid that regularly and it may come out of like a weird place but try to pull it as tight as possible When you're almost to the bottom, what you're going to do is you can either take um, a little rubber band or something and just secure it that way, but what I like to do, just so I don't like wasting your rubber bands, I just take my bobby pin and use that to hold it. So, it's held by the bobby pin as you can see. And then I just take a different section of hair that's pretty long. There's a good one. And then sort of find where it starts. Might actually take some out of this because it's a bit thick. And then this same section of hair you are going to braid. Alright, so once this is braided, you're going to just take the other braid, just try to get it out of your way as best as possible, and then you're going to take this braid and take the entire ponytail and just begin wrapping around it like this
and then the other braid Ooh, it got a little bit mixed in so if it just sort of gets in the other one carefully take it out like this and then go ahead and take your ponytail and secure it and with the other braid uh, you may need to fix the braid a bit if it fell out at all which mine did because my bobby pin fell out <laughs> And you're going to take this and twist it sort of the opposite way that you did the other one. So if you went um, over for this one, go under. And then for me, it's like sort of a double braid at the bottom. So you can just... Um, take another bobby pin and just carry it that way. Push it up through the ponytail. And then that is sort of the final look that you get. If you have longer hair, um, then you can um, curl the bottom of it if you want. But I really like the way that this turned out. Um, yeah, so you end up just getting all of these little braids wrapped around your ponytail. So it's just kind of something different. It's definitely out of my face. Um, if you wanted to braid back your bangs, I would say do a little French braid, and then you'd have just another braid. Um, but yeah, I really like the way this turned out, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.